I'm seeing my friends like really serious selfie on Twitter. <laughs> All right, so that's uh, one way to do. Hi intro. everyone, welcome I'm to good. the podcast. Yes. Uh, hey, we're on like was it six, seven? Oh, that seven. was that was really loud. Oh, I'm sorry. sorry. I have right. turned on my volume for that laugh. Yeah. Right. Hi, everyone, and welcome to episode seven of the Game Session Podcast. I'm your host, Jose okay, yeah. slash Seth Rukage. Today, I am, we are joined by Sarah. <laughs> Hello. Corey. <laughs> I didn't think of anything Hola. Our, our, our resident uh, Celtic guardian over here. Stop. Uh, <laughs> Stronger than titanium. Our tech wizard, Mesa. I mean, is, all right, I'll take it. Sure. I was, uh, I was bestowed anything. Our unofficial fifth, fifth member, Blaine, who has been on three episodes now? Three I or four? I petition to call this episode, since it's episode seven, Like a Dragon. Uh, I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought of that. <laughs> and we're also joined by uh, Nexus, longtime hey, fan, and up, now guess it on you. All right, oh we have God. a hell of a freaking panel. This is going to be a big, fat, nice and chunky, beautiful boy of an episode. Chunk. It's, like, it's just... just like the PS5. <laughs> oh my God, it's so chonky. It's really. Uh, how about it. this? Yeah, Series it's X, much too big to be called a console. Apocalypse. All right, at the top of the show, yeah. I just want to go to remind, remind everyone to every single time. Uh, like, comment, subscribe mm-hmm. on all the socials. That includes YouTube, Twitter, and Twitch. Uh, following us on all those helps us exponentially. And. We will love you if you do so. We still love you either way, but we'll extra love you. No, All right. sorry. Uh, I'm not going to extra love you. That, yeah, you I can't. That. Sorry. No extra love? Uh, what I mean, you I'll keep extra love. love them. I have a, I gotta I have keep enough my love extra to love for me right now. <laughs> 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 All right. So let's just dive straight into it with uh, Next Gen. This is going to be everything, including the consoles, the games, our experiences, yeah. whether we've gotten it or not. Mm. So. Let's start off with that. Uh, who was able to grab a next generation console? Sarah, do you want to go first? I was. Uh, so I was able, like, I physically have an Xbox Series X. Like, I'm looking at it right now. Um, it's very heavy. It's mm-hmm. a monolith. It is. Uh, I've really only had a chance to play Tetris Effect, uh, Devil May Cry 5 Special Ed- Edition, and Gears Tactics. Oh, and Gears 4. Basically, all the gears on it. Um, the the like the like multiple games running at once feature is kind of awesome uh, i just want to throw that out there i used it because i'm playing gears gears tactics and i've been playing other stuff it's really it's really great it works surprisingly well uh it's beautiful uh how's oh your god, uh how's your trying to get a ps5 situation oh going? my god please no so i mean <laughs> very long story short walmart's been fucking me over uh for those who pre-ordered from walmart uh, they oversold from their September 12th pre-order date, and so uh, mine isn't shipping out it until today if it ships out at midnight or, like, the beginning of next week. So at this point, I am exhausted, tired. I'm just going to wait for it to go on sale at, like, Amazon or Best Buy again, and I'm just going to pick it up because I'm fucking exhausted. I, I, <laughs> I have I, a PlayStation game, and I can't even play it, so... I want to say there's some irony in both Mesa and I not being able yep. to lock down a pre-order, yeah. mm-hmm. and yet Mesa and I are the first ones to actually get ours. I was so, <laughs> livid, you, the, but I was also stoked for you guys. The yeah, pre- I was, was a, for you guys. It was a pre-order it was a, game. <laughs> it was a joyous fury is what I was feeling. Yeah. <laughs> I, te- I think I technically I'm, got one a little bit earlier. So I got yeah, a day of, that's true. Day of, I think, like... I got like six hours earlier than I was supposed to, too, which is pretty exciting. Cor- Corey was uh, furiously happy, like, I'm happy for you guys. <laughs> yeah, no, that was basically <laughs> because, because, like, <laughs> because when God. you guys when you guys got one, uh, was that was that Friday morning that you got yes. it? Yes. Okay, so when you guys got one, um, Thursday, uh, my boyfriend had told me that ours had gotten delayed by like a day or whatever, and like. I usually am not super anxious about like game stuff uh, or anything because like since I became an adult, I'm just like, all right, whatever. It'll get here when it gets here. But for some weird reason, this this console launch had me so freaking anxious that I I literally was up on Friday at six in the morning and I couldn't get back to sleep. And my my PlayStation didn't arrive until like five in the afternoon. I think that's gen- that's generally how I am with hype. Like uh, 
What was yeah. the last thing I was like before this? I think the thing I was excited for was uh, the last Star Wars movie, and I don't want to get into my thoughts on that. that's a oh, whole yeah. other fucking show. Yeah, but oh, um, yeah. We can talk but just about how disappointing that was. Some exactly, other but uh, just like the hype, nev- the hype never hits me until like it's right around the corner. Like yeah, it's six months I mean, out, I'm just like say, whatever. Yeah, I will say on Tuesday I was like I got tackled the USB. <laughs> <laughs> walked in the building i was like do you have a really big package for like enter my apartment over here and he's like yeah i have more packages in the back can you give me like five minutes and i like smushed my face against the front glass of my of my fucking uh, uh, apartment building and i was just like where is it and then i see him like walking with this giant box and i'm just like yeah he's <laughs> like it's here like i yeah i would 100 percent believe that yeah I'll, uh, i'll get i'll get some time or like i don't usually get too excited until like the day before so like demon souls i was really excited when it got announced and then i kind of forgot about it a little bit and then it's the day before and i was like damn i'm gonna play a demon souls remake tomorrow that's crazy mm-hmm. I got so nexus how did you manage to uh to grab your pre-order so i got very very lucky and the day that they went live i like randomly saw i think it was an amazon link while i was at work even and i like immediately pre-ordered it and i was like uh, should I get the disc version or not? And I just immediately got the disc version. Uh, and then I just secured it. I had literally no problems. Got here on time. Uh, how how it fast securely. were you trying to get it into your uh, like card or anything? Were you like on uh, it like the minute it happened or? I was on it. I was like refreshing uh, like when I knew that the pre-orders were going up and I saw Warrior 64. I posted that the Amazon had some. So I just like kind of rushed on it. Yeah, that was how I got my Walmart one. Uh, a really good friend of mine had messaged me the link. Literally said nothing but the link. And he's like, they're up now. Get it. And I was in the middle of like getting my hair cut. I was just like, ah, just like quickly going on my phone. I, I do not believe. I don't believe that Wario 64 is a human. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's some kind of bot. Or at least he's five feet. <laughs> something like that <laughs> he's, a, or, he's like he's like fucking five five kids in like a really big that's coat. exactly yeah. where i was going <laughs> yeah <laughs> yes i'm here i am i am i'm here to buy some alcohol sir <laughs> some alcohols <laughs> I, I smoke the marijuana i inject it right into my bloodstream guys <laughs> yeah. blaine how, did you manage to grab a pre-order or buy a ps4 not P- um, fuck I'm, PS5. I'm a, I'm gonna be real. Um, I have almost nothing to add because I did not. And I've actually been balancing the two. I've been like disassociating on and off since this conversation started. So nice. Sorry. <laughs> oh, what, what are your thoughts on trying to grab one? Like, do you have a general plan for um, it? Um, I'm probably going to wait until I can clear off some credit on my Micro Center card, or that's more than fair. Yeah. yeah, just something where oh, I can get it. Responsibility is. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's that, or I'm gonna end up taking the money out of my pension again, and <laughs> just and just getting uh, two systems. I mean, on one hand, <laughs> res- financial responsibility. On the other hand, PlayStation Miles Morales. Exactly. Just remember, kids, uh, when you're an adult. Next? Just remember, the kids. When you're an adult, you team. can you can buy whatever you want, but you also have crippling depression. We'll see. Yeah. I already, <laughs> and I you also buy random shit like this. What yeah, is that? that's worth it. It's a shrimp. Is worth it. Oh, it's a shrimp. It is a shrimp. Oh, it is a little shrimp. Oh, it's a shrimp. Oh, I thought it was a shark to cool. post. I know it's uh, a bug snack. Yes, <laughs> yes. Oh, God. We we will get to that. Have a That's the title of tonight's episode. We will get cool. to that. <laughs> <laughs> I really is, but I have time. Um, Mesa and I's story is pretty similar in terms oh, yeah, of. Oh yeah, we're waiting a week for this damn What do you mean similar? It, it's exactly the same. So yeah, okay. Ma- Mesa and I did <laughs> not. Uh, Mine is the same except for twelve feet to the right. I told yeah. the 12, twelve inches to the right. That that's true. Um, <laughs> So we, we both had shit luck on pre-orders. We were both there like oh. the second they dropped. We were F5ing like crazy. Uh, we didn't get the initial pre-order. Mm. We didn't get Target when it dropped earlier this we week. And we, and we did not get either of the four drops on Walmart on, um, nope. what what was it, Wednesday night or Thursday? Uh, Thursday. It was Thursday, okay. So, so, you just yeah. did, so you just did what everyone didn't expect you to do. And that's just to walk to the freaking store and buy one in person. Exactly. <laughs> Because I think we were just joking. We we're just like, damn, like, 
we, we would really have to like go camp outside of the freaking target in order to land it. And, and I, I said that like jokingly. And then Corey's like, yeah, no, you should totally do that. I'm just like, Ugh. and then, <laughs> and I'm literally sitting there with my girlfriend reading, reading this on my phone. And she's like, are you, are you actually going to do it? I'm just like, I'm not that desperate. I have some and amount of shame. Were. <laughs> and then Mesa calls me like five minutes later saying, dude, are you down? I looked at my girlfriend. I'm like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so hey, it paid off. It paid off, man. At, yes. Absolutely worth it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so did you stay yeah. out Especially there Especially the fact that we basically it? stole it. <laughs> yeah. So, well, so. I was about to say, I thought y'all were going to tell me, like, yeah, so we found out where the dude who, like, stole, who bought, like, 30 of them and was going to scalp them lived, because the dumbass put his full name on Twitter, and I thought yeah. you were going to tell me you fucking robbed that fool. <laughs> Cracks, all right, boys. But, yeah, it, it was, like, 7 <laughs> p.m. It was, like, 7 p.m. when we PS2 said, like, yeah, we're going to do it. And, um, so what, I woke up at 2, we left mm-hmm. my house at, like, 3, we show up to the Target, and there's nobody there. We're like, yeah, nope. we're the first oh in gosh. line. But Hell there's there's yeah. but there's five chairs set up like near the entrance, but not like right next to the door. We're like, okay, some people mm-hmm. left their stuff, but they left. That means that's not technically them keeping the secret. Yeah, yeah. That, that's just there. them keep. Yeah. That's just them. Uh, that's just stuff. A chair, a chair yeah, that, that's an inanimate shit. object. The chair don't mean shit. Mm-hmm. And um, the the reason that uh that we went and did this, I. The store manager at that specific store um, was previously a manager at another company I worked with. So we're we're pretty tight. Big shout out to Jamie. You're the reason why <laughs> Mason and I got it. We knew the exact stock <laughs> and the situation. And I was kind of texting her throughout, like, as it got closer to the morning. We'll get into that. <laughs> um, but yeah, so we were there for like 30 minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, something like that. And then three people show up. And they, they go sit in the chairs like, okay, so yeah, we're in front of the line. These people are five. We knew that there were going to be exactly five consoles there. So we, we think, yeah, we're good. And uh, mm-hmm. a couple more people show up throughout the night. Mesa and I are just chilling, playing Mario Kart. Uh, Mesa, you're a dick for hitting me with so many red shells. <laughs> wait, 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 it was right you guys, in front of what, it was wrong. Yeah. What, what time did you guys get there? At like like 3.30. Okay, yeah. three, three. So, okay. So, so yeah. wait, you said that there was five chairs up front. Did 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 those people show up, or did you just take their chairs? No, no. We, I brought my own chair. Uh, yeah, but, I but, didn't. But, but three people <laughs> showed up for those chairs. But as the as the uh, I say night, but as the morning went on. Uh, that group got like a shit ton more people in the group. Like it came out of the woodwork, and then there was like a group of like eight or nine of them, and and they were starting to say stuff like, "Well, we were here since last night." Uh, Get your so that chairs were here from last night, dumbass. Yeah, it's like yeah. so. There's there's five of us. So that means mm-hmm. we're getting the five. Like, no, there was no one. We're here, and thankfully, where we were uh, positioned, uh, there was a camera right behind us. So like, look, there's a camera right there. They're gonna know for a fact. I know the manager. She's gonna get have my back on this. <laughs> I'm, I'm oh, pulling dude. the Karen card right now. Mm-hmm. I don't so care. Wait, is, I, that, I, is that what she actually did? Huh? Oh no, because we. Uh, I mean, if I was completely in the wrong, she she would have had to you know go with the people that were in the right. But I, we were in the right. Yeah, we were. But um, oh. yeah, don't put your but chairs was... in a line. It doesn't count as saving but a the, spot. No, well, the problem <laughs> is that like there was, there was the the, uh, the A as a group. So you know, we established that we were here. You know, last night with the people who were last here. And there's a we were like, uh oh, you know. We were getting we were getting nervous for a while, but it it basically three came, hours. <laughs> it, it came down to that distinction of does it matter if you were here last night, but you left? Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. Right. Nuts. Left. If you left, yeah. you left. It's exactly. like you should have you should have kept someone there to save your spots. Yeah. And mm-hmm. we actually I got mean, we got very lucky in the, in that if we had shown up while they were still there, like at two. Then we probably would have been shit out of luck. We showed up like at the exact perfect time when they left because if we showed up mm-hmm. when there were people there, then they probably would have, you know, left someone there to say like, "I'm yeah, holding these yeah. guys a spot." Well, I mean, this is the same thing. But when I met uh, Kojima back in November of last year, when 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 Death Stranding came out, there there had been people who had literally fucking slept outside of the GameStop overnight oh, wow. at like one in one in the morning and what they had done was it was like a group of nine people they didn't bring fucking tents they just took turns sleeping and someone stood up like stayed up the whole time <laughs> to make sure that like no one stole anything mm-hmm. and they're like yeah, oh yeah, we a, just like we just like took turns sleeping you gotta have a spot and it was like exactly mm-hmm. 
<laughs> yeah, as the uh, God, as, yeah, as the morning progressed and the like, some of the employees started saying like, "Okay, form a line." Like mm-hmm. we were already the closest to the door to the as door. possible. Yeah, and so like, I take a couple steps back so the lady who's opening the door can actually step out. She says, okay, form a line, whoever's first. I'm like, okay, we're here first. They have camera proof. And these fucking assholes from the other group, they butt in in front of me. And like, fuck social distancing, whatever. And they wow. just like butt their way to the front of the line. Like, this automatically makes me first. I'm like, fuck off. Fucking dicks. So wait, but, like, uh, did you fight them? So wait, did you? Did you- I, I did not want to get into a heated argument. I stood very firm yep. by, the, by the position there is a camera. We are factually the first people here. I'm, mm. And that's, indis- and that's uh, indisputable. Mm-hmm. But so uh, were you the first ones in the door, or were they? You, I, we'll, we'll get to that. Okay. Yeah. But uh, oh, like the, the anxiety oh, of the last three hours, because like we were very oh, yeah. confident the we were going to get changed. it. Changed. We were. We, I was talking to. <laughs> the vibe uh, changed instantly. I, I was talking That's to Jamie, happened. my my friend who's the manager there, and um, I'm just like, oh fuck, like because she wasn't working that day. And, um, so it came down to like, whoever's in the store, whatever they found on the recording. So I'm just like, oh fuck, what if they accidentally, well, not accidentally, what if they go the other way? Mm-hmm. So we were still nervous. It's like, fuck, dude, we spent six hours or like five hours being out here. This is going to be a hell of a disappointment if we don't get it. Uh, so the anxiety was real for like two to three hours. Mm-hmm. And I, w- I was putting on a little bit of a fake, uh, facade of confidence for Mesa. Cause I could tell <laughs> he was feeling it. <laughs> Ooh. Oof. But uh, what's like, the act? I don't think I told you this, but um, the second that they said that and there was that dispute, I mm. uh, on my phone went to PlayStation Direct. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> uh, I did not know here. that. I <laughs> um, wanted to make sure either way you secure the bag. Exactly. I, I just I do not like confrontation, so I don't know how I would. Yeah, have I can't I know. Say I basically I, like, hey, you're you you're handling this for me because yeah. I can't do this. To, to yeah, Mesa's kind say, like, of a midnight launch story, even though I got mine like in the mail because I like work at Target, right? <sighs> I got there at three a.m. to go to work because I like do the truck, right? And these guys are lined up and they're coming over to me and my like coworkers and they're like, "Hey, buddies, there's a line," and I'm like. Yeah, dude. Hey, motherfucker, and we gotta I go to here. work. <laughs> we work here. And then he's like crowding around us and asking, like, hey, do you know how many PS5s they have? Do you know like how they're gonna be distributing them? I'm like, brother, <laughs> they don't even let me touch the PS5s. You think they let me sell them? I touch I put bleach up all day. I don't know about a PS5. <laughs> and then they like kept crowding around us. Well, our manager is not gonna let us in if he's near us. So we had to like tell them to get away from us Jeez. right exactly oh, people are people are insane when it comes to video game yeah. launches dude Absolutely. it's oh god i yeah. i would like Sorry, to... i don't know if you also worked the smash brothers launch but i did and i wanted to kill myself no i i did i did work multiple different launches though i can't remember um which one was the craziest it was the though, worst I oh the smash one was the worst mm-hmm. we sold out at like 12 in the afternoon and I have people coming up, I'm like, I could sell you a digital copy. And people are like, I don't want a digital copy. I'm like, well, we don't have any. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> we have any physical copies. I'm like, I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. It's like, I- just please, Smash Smash players, go away. <laughs> like, please. And you know they smell bad, too. Oh, they really <laughs> I'm glad I don't have a sense of smell. Think fucking no, just like take a sh- take a shower, guy. Wash your balls, please. Like, for God's sake. Well, no, like I need to know. So, what happened when you guys went into the Target? Uh, uh, we'll, we'll get to. <laughs> and, um, no. But but so, uh, to Mace is very good credit because he is the one of the goodest boys I know in the world. Um. And I, I you typically don't like being too confrontational. Like, if I accidentally bump into someone in a grocery store, I'll, I'll say sorry first. I don't care. That's not a yeah, fucking fight I want to get into. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. But but for this, I was... I, I've been trying to be more assertive over, over the years. And this is definitely a situation where I'm just like, I'm not going to be a dick. I'm just going to state the fact and leave it at that. The less you say is, is more sometimes. Mm-hmm. I'm curious but, what uh, this person looked like. An asshole. Because I, I, I have a vision in my head, and I feel like this person... <laughs> Was a taller. Uh, I vision like backwards hat. Like yeah, I mean there was a bunch of them, but it was like, the, 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 the two big ones. It was a mom. There was there was like two Four. small moms that were assholes. Yeah. yeah, which you know, which honestly that was the part that scared me. It was like, oh no, it's a mom. 
We're fucked. Oh yeah, <laughs> the monster <laughs> trying to secure it for Christmas is what it is. Yeah. Oh. I. Yeah. No, we are pretty damn sure just based off the number there that that they were fucking scalpers. There's no way. Oh yeah. You, you do not need five PS5s in your fucking household. No, you don't. You and, maybe uh, need like like maybe two or th- like I could see two, three, or four based on like if you're a parent getting like one for your house and then let's say you have like a a family member, you have another family member. I could even believe that. But five? Yeah, one no, person fuck that. buying five? No, fuck, no, no, no. But uh, as soon as the asset person came out, they verified that uh, Mesa and I were there first. Um, Mason and I just looked at each other. We just, I know Mason doesn't have a camera right now, but we had the dumbest <laughs> face of, oh, and, uh, he said like, yep, you can come to the front of the line. I just dead at the guy's name was Freddie. I looked at him like, Freddie, I love you, dude. <laughs> and we got in and, and like, maybe it's because I was tired is all hell, but we, we got mm-hmm. into the target and they said like, oh, congratulations. You waited this long. I felt like everyone or all the employees around me were like clapping for me. Like this was like that some kind of like ceremony. That is exactly I was thinking the same thing. That is exactly what it felt like. Uh, oh, like, you know, so I, I finished. I finished. I finished at the um, at the um, at the uh, what's it called again? The 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 cashier before Jose did. So I so I stepped aside and was waiting. And security guy went to me. He's like, "Oh man, uh, so you, so you're getting to buy or sell? You're gonna play that or sell it?" I'm like, Come on, "I've I've put in too much fucking effort to sell this." Hell yeah, yeah. As, as soon as I got mine, I went to Mason. Just like, dude, we gotta like make a beeline to your car because I'm sure some of those Ooh. other people are real salty over this. Oh yeah. How did you feel? How oh, did you? What was the feeling when the you had? Home. When you when you like shut your trunk and got into the car we laughed <laughs> all the way home <laughs> it, it was it was like we there was still like some anxiety still leaving our body it was being tired it was it was pure happiness but we just they, laughed the whole they were, time they were gonna follow you, <laughs> they were follow you like we were in you to get to, to get the fucking playstation <laughs> see <laughs> see y'all y'all are better than me because while i have immense issues with confrontation i just shut down but I guess it's because of the fact that I've grown up in New York that I've hit this point where I don't I stopped caring and instead like I would have been walking out with the PS5 in my hands and as I left past the line I would have just said you suck my dick from the back and just fucking left. <laughs> <laughs> just so, <laughs> see like it was so weird because I remember when oh. when I waited in line to meet to meet Koji everybody was just so like welcoming and just so like oh, oh, happy the, to be there <laughs> there were there were like three people that were that were waiting in line that we, we were super cordial with we were just chatting whatever mm-hmm. and like you know that's how midnight launch is supposed to be everyone's like there for for the same thing it's supposed to be community even if not everybody's getting something but the yeah. second those people like try to like butt their way in i'm just like ooh, the vibe changed the last three hours mm-hmm. everyone was real well, quiet like, well like my favorite story is so when i met him i bought the collector's edition of death stranding and i wasn't even like going to get it i was like oh i'm here they have it why not and the and the few people that had like parked in line and had slept in line they were cheering everybody every time somebody walked out with the game they were like yeah oh, oh, <laughs> and i awesome. and i walk out yeah. and i'm like five foot four hundred and six six sixty <laughs> pounds and that collector's edition was heavy so i'm like hauling it over my head and they go yeah and they stop halfway through yay and the biggest dude lowers his arms and he goes do you need help? Because he can just like see me like struggling, <laughs> and he's like, "Do you need help? Do you want me to walk it back to your spot in line?" I was like, That's "No, so I got nice. it. It's okay." And I haul it over my head, and then everyone goes, "Yeah!" Oh my God. <laughs> like everyone just continues cheering as I'm like walking past them, and I'm like, "Thank you to like the dude who offered to help," and he was like, "It's no problem." Like I was just like struggling to carry this fucking thing. I was just like, "I can't do it." Activate your demon. Just... Activate your demon form. <laughs> I did it just just to make them cheer. Like I can't believe you guys dealt. I mean, th- thankfully there were a few people online who were super nice. I'm just so used to waiting in line. Everyone just being like a fucking like wonderful human being and just like so excited for for everybody else. All right. For the let's, most let's... part. Oh, I'm sorry. sorry. Go ahead, Corey. I was gonna say for the most part, um, being a a person waiting in line for midnight launches and stuff like that. Typically people are very camaraderie and everything. Um, there's hardly any situations that where, you know, Jose and Mason experience where there's, you know, assholes in line. Um, the, at least that I've experienced personally. 
I, I, I think what it also made it more stressful is that Mason and I pretty much damn well knew there's basically no way we were going to be able to get one of these until like next year at this point. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, maybe during Black Friday, but like, maybe. Uh, yeah, so, it, 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 uh, it's not worth it. Hey, Sarah. So, so, so uh, from what? Hmm. Oh, I'm hmm. sorry. Go ahead. Uh, I, I was just gonna say, from what I read, and I don't know if this is accurate or not, but I know apparently GameStop is getting like one or two per store on Black Friday. Oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> one or so, two. One or two. I'm yeah. From sorry. what I heard, from what I've heard. Yeah. That's so, gonna be so rough. that's gonna be right. Yeah. <laughs> so Sarah, I, I believe. I wonder if they just physically don't have enough capital to buy enough for their stores. They probably I, don't anymore. They probably don't have enough. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're just yeah. Because like, they were they were bankrupt until Microsoft was like, "Hey, we'll throw you a bone." Yeah. Right. Exactly. Mm-hmm. 